So it's been a packed first day of the Africa Climate Summit here in Nairobi, Kenya, the Kenyatta International Convention Center, where the Ghanaian delegation has been strong as all of Africa comes together really in a last minute push to have the global financial architecture changed ahead of COP28 in Saudi Arabia. Amongst the many individuals from Ghana who have taken the time to be at the plenary session was Minister of State in charge of finance, Dr. Amin Adam, who amongst many things reiterated the importance for the African continent to find the right balance in terms of being able to have its natural resources recognized. We need to be able to go to the market, okay, and, and, and borrow but we want the market environment to be right for us. We must be able to borrow at, you know, rates that, you know, pertains to how much developed countries borrow, okay? We need fairness in the international capital market so that we can compete rather than, you know, relying on grants and uh, moving around with uh, bold uh, asking for aid and, and those things which come with conditions that we cannot uh, uh, be able to, 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 to meet. Well, there were also speeches from the energy minister, Dr. Matthew Poku Prempe, who was critical at one of the conversations on carbon marketing, seeking to have the African continent leverage on being one of the biggest lungs of the world. But for Lands and Natural Resources Minister Samuel Abujinapo, the conversation on carbon marketing only gives the Ghanaian government the impetus to reclaim lands ravaged by illegal mining. We have to work together across the government divide to tap into the carbon market, raise significant amounts of funding to be able to uh, promote afforestation, reclamation of our degraded land, revegetation, and generally restore the forest and landscape of our country Ghana. The consensus, meanwhile, appears to be one of unison, where African leaders are seeking to have the narrative change. On Tuesday, the 5th of September, expectations on the climate architecture and financial architecture will be pivotal and central in all of the debates where Ghana's president, Nanado Dankwe Kufuado, is expected to play a key role. From here in the Kenyatta International Convention Center, Eric Mawinagbeta, TV3 News.